Hi, I'm Aaron Little and this is Performance Edge. And in today's video, I want to I want to touch on a story that I, I've seen posted several times on Facebook. I don't know if it's true or not. I guess in the end, I hope I hope it's not. But if it is, it, it worked out awesome. And you may have seen it, but just real quick, uh, 911 dispatch gets a phone call. Um, and they ask what's your emergency and the lady on the other end of the line starts ordering a pizza and there's obviously some confusion dispatch keeps asking her questions and she keeps responding as if she's ordering a pizza finally dispatch for whatever reason asked um, ma'am is there an emergency and the lady on the other end of the phone other end of the line said yes and then dispatch says, is there someone there that you can't talk in front of? And the lady said yes. And they dispatched police. Police got there. It was a domestic violence situation. The woman was safe. The man went to jail. You know, the, all the things in the story. What's awesome, if that's a true story, what's awesome is that that lady had the, the forethought to fake a call to... A pizza place and instead called 911 and it's awesome that the dispatch recognized the subterfuge and I, that's great and I like I said I hope the story's not real because I hope the woman wasn't being assaulted but it, it, it brings to mind this thought um, something that I do and I, I never really thought of making a YouTube video about it until this story but the importance of, of a couple maybe three code words phrases things that you and your teammates you and your spouse for me that's kind of one in the same but phrases that you use that that you can work into just regular conversation that means something to you and that other person and no one else would catch on now i know that sounds like I'm, that's some kind of paranoid thing but if you think about it if you had three words or three phrases one that meant i don't like this one that meant we have to go now and one that meant it's on well those could be used for lots of different things i don't like this could simply mean i really don't like this but i don't want these other people to know that i'm telling you i don't like it or it could mean this is a bad situation we need to go could, could simply mean i'm tired and i want to go but i don't want to tell our friends that i want to leave so let's come up with a reason to leave or it could mean, I think things are about to go bad, we need to get out of here. And then it's on. Well, that, that kind of speaks for itself. But if we have that, if we, if we develop the, those codes or those words, those phrases, and we practice that, we practice it so if and when you have to use it for real, there's no guessing as to what's going on. Then we have a means of communication in front of other people, like that lady who called 911 and pretended it was... Uh, to order a pizza. If we have that ability, then it, it just really adds to the effectiveness of our teamwork. Just a thought, something inspired from a Facebook post. I, I use it in my life. I, I think it's a good idea. Uh, if you have thoughts about that, leave it in the comments below. I would love to hear what, you, what you're thinking. And uh, please consider subscribing to our channel. I'm Aaron Little. This is Performance Edge. Thanks.